yes, this is the right thing to do because we need those uh, nurses, those doctors in the NHS because there is such a shortage. But we have, in the last hour or so, had reaction from the Health Secretary, Jeremy Hunt himself. He's been speaking at the NHS Confederation in Manchester. Uh, there is a huge upscaling of capacity in global health systems. The World Health Organization says there's a 2.6 million shortage of doctors across the world, a 9 million shortage of nurses. And if we are going to address those issues, we have to be training on a sustainable basis. But once we do that, and that's why I am so proud that we have now got 25% increases in both doctor training places, nurse training places, and midwife training places. Once we do that, we are then able to make the argument that in the period between now and when those training places uh, convert into fully trained clinicians, uh, the government should be flexible on visas. And that's why it is uh, extremely welcome that today the Prime Minister has announced that doctors and nurses will be removed from the Tier 2 visa caps, which means that the NHS will be able to recruit the number of doctors and nurses that we need from overseas. And I think what's interesting about this is that the Home Secretary hasn't been in his job very long, that's Sajid Javid, and already we are seeing the unpicking of some of those extremely uh, restrictive elements of the immigration policy that have been put in place by Theresa May when she was in the